nighttime showdown oh, as Dean work. Ambrose goes one on one with John Cena. You ain't stepped up, you fell off. You must be mistaken me for somebody who gives a damn what you say. You know what you are to be done? You're a lazy part timer because you can't get it done in the ring anymore. I need a t shirt and bless it. You're all plus. We're just getting started. No single collide to the rules to the Intercontinental Championship. One more time. Just you. Which one was that? I deleted something. By accident. Okay. Did I just the fridge? Yeah, I did. Gentlemen, in less than three weeks' time, the SmackDown Women's Championship is going to be defended oh, for the very first time now? at no mercy. And tonight, we are going to have the first ever SmackDown Live Women's Contract signing. Now I know how these things can get, but we are going to keep things civil. This is, don't boo that. This is SmackDown Live, and this is a new era, and that's how it's going to be. So let me introduce you to the SmackDown Women's Champion, Becky Lynch! I hope this is really quick, because I just don't want this to drag on. I think I missed a few of the things I said. It's just good. She was the number one draft pick, and that pick justified the fact that she became the inaugural SmackDown Women's Champion. The childhood dream realized. Former NFL champion Daniel Tucker, but you know what else is a childhood dream? Is her number one challenger now at no mercy, that being Alexa Bliss. Yes, it is, and this girl has taken the women's division by storm. Now, Becky, let me just reiterate what I said earlier. We are going to keep things civil, correct? Correct, correct. Don't worry, I got my thick skin on. Come at me, bro. Okay, with that said, we are going to introduce the number one contender to the SmackDown Women's Championship, Alexa Bliss. I can't tell over your hair and dead. And the spider dominion of stature, Alexa Bliss has proven to be as big a badass as her cinematic equivalent, Harley Quinn. Her meteoric rise on SmackDown Live has seen her become the number one contender from the SmackDown oh, Women's Championship. Yeah, let's go back to last Tuesday, yeah, the yeah. Fatal Five Way. All the women compete, they all yeah. want a second chance to try to earn that right there in Becky Lynch's game. It's just a matter of a fatal five ways. Sometimes I'm being in the right place at the right time. Nikki looked like she had it, but Carmella stuck her. Looking to take over, but exactly what you said, John, being in the right place at the right time. Alexa able to capitalize. First opportunity to be a number one contender. Alexa Bliss capitalized. Can she capitalize on this opportunity now of being the next women's champion on SmackDown? Good. Becky, is that what you call it? <laughs> and here I thought you had the hide of a rhino, but <laughs> it's called moisturizer, sweetheart. I'll get to it. <laughs> See, that's the difference between you and me. While you're preparing for a pageant, I'm preparing for a fight. Yeah. 
Becky, that is not the only difference between you and me. Thank God. I mean, my God, I can't even look at you walking around with that title over your shoulder and around your waist because you don't fit the role as a champion. I actually think it, it fits quite nicely, I think. That's, that's... No, 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 no. That's not even what I'm talking about. I'm talking about your role in life, Becky. Your role in life is not to be a champion. Your role in life is to be the woman that succeeds, then fails miserably. You know it's true. And then, afterwards, you go back to doing what you do best, being the lovable superstar that never quite gets it. That's your life story, Bex. And honestly, subconsciously, well, you know that. I know that. And you know you're gonna lose your title. Because you weren't born to be a champion, Becky. <laughs> you were born to be a loser. Oh, yeah, you're right. I know I'm right. You're right, I was not born to be a champion. You're right, Alexa, I was not born to be a champion. I was born to live in a small house by the side of the road in Dublin. I was born to work a job I didn't like and barely make ends meet. You're right, I was not, I was not born to be a champion. But I watched far too much TV and I listened when they told me that if I believed in myself, I could be anything that I wanted to be. And I wanted to be champion. I wanted to be champion real bad. That's right, Alexa. I was not born to be champion, but just like every other superstar that has walked down that aisle, I have poured my heart and my soul into this so that I can raise this above my head. No, no, Alexa, I was not born Alexa, to be a champion, but I want cry. this. And I want this a whole lot more than you do. And if you think that you are going to take this from me at no mercy, I will rip your head off. I was not born to be a champion. I fought to be a champion. Oh my God, I mean, that was so inspirational. Please, oh, Becky, the difference, here's the thing, between you and me, you were always destined for second place because I was born to be a champion, Becky. And to be honest, at no mercy, I'm gonna take that title from you and expose you for what you really are, a one-hit wonder. Championship, she might indeed be classified as a one hit wonder. Well, she's just made an official signing the contract. We have That's a championship good. match. Good. Good. Becky Lynch against Alexa Bliss two weeks from this Sunday at no mercy, only on the WWE Network. Tensions continue to rise. And don't forget, coming up again, two weeks from Sunday, at No Mercy, the maiden voyage for Becky Lynch 
and SmackDown Women's Champion as she defends against the Spitfire Alexa Bliss. And high stakes tag team match coming up. The Usos, Life, Future, and Exact Fork on a new level of aggression. It'll be the Usos against American. I don't know what he was going for there, but it didn't play with.